。二零二四年是中美建交四十五周年。一月七号至十号，二零二四年美东地区首个青年访华团由二十九名学生代表组成的美国哥伦比亚大学青年学生代表团到访成都。四天时间里，代表团成员们在成都探访大熊猫、拜水都江堰，走进成都的校园、乡村和创新中心等地，通过考察、参访、交流互动，亲身体验当地历史文化底蕴和经济社会发展。在行程的最后一站——西南交通大学。代表团成员们参观西南交通大学轨道交通运载系统全国重点实验室，随后上车体验磁悬浮列车，切身感受中国科技发展速度。I don't have a science background, so everything is almost like magic to me. This has really impressed me because once again, I think sustainability is such a big issue right now. I think it's very cool being here and seeing how concerned everyone is about the environment and air quality, and I think it's wonderful that you know. 在成都浦江县铁牛村，徽派建筑民居从街头延伸至街尾。村道两旁都是挂满柑橘的果树。代表团成员们在这里通过柑橘芒实体验下地采摘柑橘等活动，感受中国乡村之美。And one of the classes that we take is called Universal Food Security. So we learn a lot about the practices of agriculture. We learn about food tilling, a types of soil. So for me, it's interesting to see this in person rather than in a classroom. I've heard of Chinese agriculture. I've heard about how the country did the whole、um, rural revitalization project, how it overcome poverty through projects such as agriculture. So it's very interesting for me to see it in person. Good taste, excellent taste, very sweet. 在成都期间，代表团成员不仅在都江堰景区体验长嘴壶茶艺表演，感受太极寺两拨千斤，沉浸式感受了成都地方文化魅力，还走进青城山高级中学与学生打成一片，并向校内学生拜师，学习杂染技艺。I had no idea that tie dye was、uh, an ancient Chinese art.、Um, I had just assumed that it was just always part of our lives in America. We always had tie dye shirts when we were younger, but to learn that it was an ancient Chinese art is fascinating. And、uh, otherwise, the The tour of the school is great, and、uh, it's good to see all the kids playing outside and playing PE. And everyone has been very kind and very welcoming. And I think it's important for both Chinese and Americans to experience the other culture. We both have a lot to offer, and、uh, it'll help us grow together and cooperate in the future. 奥琼道马赛是美国哥伦比亚大学国际事务硕士，研究政治经济发展。他认为，国际关系的核心是建立不同文化间理解的桥梁，让不同群体求同存异。此次成都之行达到了这一目的。I think at the core of international relations, it's all about building bridges, understanding cultures, different communities, getting to know one another, realizing the differences, but also, more importantly, realizing the similarities. And I think this trip exactly served that purpose. We realize the beautiful differences that all of us share, and we also realize the similarities that we share. And I think, you know, as future change makers in international relations. We will be remembering these bridges.